We are at 2728 Robbie Street in Halifax, Nova Scotia, and behind me is the Center for Islamic Development. It may be the most green, ecological, sustainable, environmentally responsible uh, Islamic building anywhere in Canada. It was designed that way when Brother Ziaullah Khan envisioned such an institution as lacking in his town, Halifax. The building is currently zoned for an additional four stories for a maximum of eight. So all this space up here is currently being fundraised for and inshallah, God alone willing, this empty space will be filled. The foundation of the building actually has been designed to sustain a building which goes beyond the current zoning regulations to 12 stories, which is up there in the sky. One can aspire zoning changes around the neighborhood more buildings are coming they're taller apartments and commercial towers are possible and expected the center for islamic development is itself still in development the neighborhood around the immediate neighborhood around the Center for Islamic Development has already been bought and zoned by developers for development but of a different kind. There are apartment buildings coming, other buildings are also coming, so for the Center for Islamic Development if they wish to increase and serve the growing Muslim community here in Halifax, they can't expand on the ground. They actually have to grow up. And the building has a solid foundation which can handle up to 12 standard stories. The current zoning in the neighborhood allows for a maximum of eight floors the floors that have been designed into the blueprints into the uh, future expansion plans of the building have higher than standard roofs so those eight floors actually come to maybe six or at most seven floors but I believe the number is six the only way to grow is up so here is where another couple of floors and a skylight is currently being fundraised for. And that, inshallah, God alone willing, is in the coming few years in the development the physical building development of the Center for Islamic Development in Halifax. This is another view of the Center for Islamic Development in Halifax. We zero in to the roof, we get a much better, closer look at the solar tubing. This is what allows the water to be heated. The center can save a lot of money. It is different than solar paneling. It has allowed the water to be heated. And as any observer of Muslim places of worship knows, when it comes to ablution, wudu, which is the washing 
which is necessary before the prayer, we go through a lot of water. The solar tubing, and there's a little bit better, closer look at it, goes a long way to creating a sustainable, balanced idea. for Islamic buildings that should be green. The Center for Islamic Development at 2728 Robbie Street in Halifax is on one of the busiest roads, streets, in the city it's on a major bus line, it's easy to get to by public transit obviously. It has a very interesting neighbor, a beer company. The owners of the Good Robot beer brewing company here next door to the Center for Islamic Development are doing their best to be good neighbors. They actually asked for a prayer schedule to put up on the wall and when the prayer times would come they wanted to know what time they should turn down the volume uh, so people could pray uh, with less of a distraction. Love thy neighbor, even if they're a beer company and a masjid, a Muslim house of worship. Good robot, good neighbors, somewhere in the middle. The Center for Islamic Development, like any other newer house of worship in Canada's cities, does have the issue of limited parking in the immediate vicinity. Brother Zia, Zia Ola Khan, who is the energy and the idealist behind the Center for Islamic Development, is encouraging Muslims to carpool or ride a bicycle when they come to the center. That's something you don't usually hear from the mimbar from the announcements that happen on Fridays and at other times but carpooling it's a different idea for Muslims when they think of trekking out to the masjid for the regular prayers and riding a bicycle though it's very healthy it's uh, something that cities are putting infrastructure in it's not again something that you usually hear from leaders of masjids and Islamic centers that's a nice surprise and it goes along with the overall philosophy of being green, sustainable, balanced and responsible in an environmental way when building new institutions, bringing new ideas and thinking of what the next generation of Canadian Muslims will want and need. This is Himi Syed for 30 Mustards, 30 Mustards Canada, traveling across Canada this Ramadan 2016. We began in St. John's, Newfoundland. We've been here in Halifax, Nova Scotia, and we're about to continue uh, points uh, northeast and west into New Brunswick, Charlottetown, uh, Quebec, and points west. Himi Syed. 30 Mustards, 30 Mustards Canada, 30mustards.ca at the Center for Islamic Development in Halifax, Nova Scotia.